you. And of course, this is the first time in decades that a wildfire is threatening homes near Hag Lake. Dozens of people under evacuation orders. Our Jennifer Hoff caught one family. They had to grab their dogs and just go. The Red Cross is at Forest Grove's Dilly School to accommodate at least 32 homeowners who were told this afternoon to just get out. When they say evacuate now, you go. Pat Costa picked up and left his Scoggins Valley Road home near Hag Lake Friday afternoon. The fire is a mile and a half from there, and a reverse 911 call alerted homeowners like Costa, who escaped with his wife and four dogs. This is the closest in the 24 years we've lived here that I've seen it. Um, it is somewhat off putting, <laughs> you know, to say the least. We found out the Red Cross doesn't allow dogs in its shelter, so the couple will keep looking for a hotel while the volunteers unload supplies into the school gym for other evacuees. This is unusual for our Portland people to be deployed, but it's not unusual this late in the summer for us to be having these wildfires. It's just that they're happening so close to home. There's a level one evacuation for nearly a dozen other roads in the area, and that means they should get ready to leave. The Red Cross will stay at the school all night and then reassess again in the morning, depending on how big the fire has grown and how many people end up staying here. There are cots, food, and drink for anyone who might need it. Reporting in Forest Grove, Jennifer Hoff, Coin 6 News.